Hey guys, I'm showing you what I need and do on my long haul flights. First, let's go over some of my personal rules. One, my hands do not touch my face. Trust me, you don't want to be touching anything on a plane, then sticking those fingers in product, then touching your face. Ew. Next, I keep it simple. I don't want to bring a lot with me on board, and I do not want to get involved with anything overly complicated. Just trying to keep things balanced until I'm back on terra firma. It's all about hydration and moisturization. That's it. Everything else is simply gratuitous. I'm not concerned about exfoliating or anything like that. So not too long into the flight, I get out my cleansing wipes, and I wipe off all that's built up from the madness before getting on the plane. I'm not a huge fan of wipes, but I love these ones from Tony Moly. They are full of product and hydration. Smells fresh, feels refreshing, and gets the grossness off. I also get the heaviest facial mist and use that as a moisturizer, misting throughout the flight. This one keeps the skin surface moisturized and tacky and doesn't seem to completely evaporate as it's got plenty of oils and humectants. I also find the richest lip balm for my lips to reapply throughout the flight. This cute little banana from Tony Moly stays on through it all. This would be my first sheet mask of my 15 hour flight. This one is for hydration, so it's a hyaluronic one. And I use only sheet masks. Again, no fingers to product to face situations. I find a lot of people on flights use sheet masks, particularly on the Asian ones. Now I relax for 15 to 20 minutes. You don't want the mask to get dry because then it would already have started absorbing hydration back from your skin. After removing, leave the product on your face to absorb and protect. Drink a lot of water. When I'm ready to sleep, I use one of my favorite products, which is this Lavender Warming Steam Eye Mask. This is so relaxing and feels so warm and wonderful on tired eyes, I fall right asleep. This warms up immediately and creates a little steam. It feels great and so comfortable. After waking up, or a couple of hours before landing, it's time for sheet mask number two, which is a moisturizing one. I'm using an avocado oil mask. Before landing, I do a little touch up, nothing too much, but I'm being picked up at the airport, so I'm just being considerate. My mask provides a good moisture base for my Hera UV Mist Ultra Moisture Cushion, which I use under my eyes and around my nose. This has just enough coverage to brighten me up and looks natural. A girl has to have mascara. and some brow gel. I love my Maybelline Baby Skin Cheek Flush. It gives a natural, healthy flush and glowy, dewy sheen to the skin. Again, this is quite moisturizing. I use the cushion puff to gently blend it out. and my favorite tinted lip oil. And we're done! Thanks for watching guys, I hope you enjoyed this. Please subscribe and like, and I'll see you next time. Bye! Attention passengers, we've now reached our destination. We hope you enjoyed the flight and have a nice day.